We have breaking news from the business world. A major U.S. alcohol maker is about to snap up a big chunk of Canada's cannabis sector. Let's go live now to 680's Richard Southern for the latest. Richard, what does this mean uh, for the Canadian cannabis sector as well as for the markets later today? It's huge. It means, Tammy, that big alcohol wants to own Canadian cannabis. Constellation Brands, Tammy, these are the guys that make Corona beer, Robert Mondavi wine. They're one of the biggest alcohol producers in the world. They're spending $5 billion this morning to take a 38% ownership stake in Canopy Growth. That is the biggest Canadian pot producer. Uh, it is just massive. Uh, it shows now that, that big alcohol, that big U.S. companies are comfortable getting into the Canadian pot space. It also comes, Tammy, as sales of beer and wine fall. People are looking at the negative effects of alcohol. They're not buying it as much. You look at Colorado and California, where uh, cannabis is already legal. Alcohol sales have plummeted. So these alcohol guys, they're looking at that and they're saying, we got to own this space. we got to get into it. Tammy, the idea is that they will come out, and they have already in the States, with uh, beer and wine that is non-alcohol but has cannabis in it. So you get that same sort of buzz, but you don't get any of the calories and you don't get any of the negative effects of alcohol. I'll tell you this $5 billion investment this morning, Tammy, it's really going to move uh, a canopy growth stock. And I would argue it's really going to move the TSX significantly higher as the expectation. This is big news today. All right, we'll see how that goes. And Richard, can I ask you as well, do you think that this will lead to uh, Canadian, other Canadian companies trying to get a bigger stake in the cannabis market, other Canadian alcohol makers yep. or other companies who can dabble in this? Somehow? Well, you know who we haven't heard from yet? Big Tobacco. And we know how their products have been challenged. Wouldn't they like to get in? That's been the speculation, Tammy. Uh, you're going to see uh, this as well disrupt the medical industry, and I wouldn't be surprised to see big pharma start to nip away. Up until now, these companies have been reluctant to do it, but now that we know when it's going to be legal in Canada, cannabis, I think big Fortune 500 companies like Constellation, they're comfortable now taking an ownership stake. All right, we'll see how this all plays out on the markets this morning. We have about an hour and a half before they open. so We'll, we'll keep you updated. All right, thanks very much, Richard. Thanks.